uh, in this video I will show you how the uh, image gallery works for the property record uh, so I am currently logged into the production arc and let me go to the uh, properties page so there are few of the records but for the testing purpose I am creating a new record basically so let me give the property in app test property <coughs> let me select uh, the random address this is my home address so I'm selecting some uh, uh, populating some data on this space uh, state address city state zip code uh, these are the only required for to show the map Google map basically and uh, these are the only required fields now I'm clicking on save button So here we get getting the property page. Um, so here we can see the another tab called map and uh, images. So uh, I have added it uh, in this section. So uh, once you click on it, it will show you the map, uh, the marker on the map, the position of the address over the map. So here you can see that the address whatever we added here it's just rendered that po its position on the map you can just scroll down up and down you can perform all the tasks that you all the functions that you normally do with the map. So this is the section where you can see the map and below that uh, we have added the another section which called image gallery uh, you can add the a number of images to this particular property so uh, here you can see the upload files button once you click on it you you will be able to select 10 files at a time so i'm just let uh, for the testing purpose i'm just selecting uh, these uh, 10 files uh, so let's uh, select four files as of now or uh, for the so that it uh, they can be uploaded fast so once I uh, selected those files, uh, they are being uploaded now. Okay, all the files are uploaded now. It uh, you need to click on done button. So as soon as click on done and all the files are uploaded, you can see the uh, uh, the whatever files you uploaded the right uh, in this section. You can click on any or one of the image. It will simply show you the output or the uh, high definition image with the original size in this particular window you can click right click and open image in new tab to uh, see or download that particular file it will get downloaded in the Google Chrome as you can see over here you can close and open another file uh, another image to see um, or the uh, it will just uh, preview that particular image uh, so you can uh, again add any number of 10 or uh, 10, uh, 10 images at a time but you can add in unlimited images over here uh, so another functionality is to delete the image so here you can see that the button is delete selected so if you haven't selected any of the file and just click on delete selected button it will show you the warning as please select at least one image so as of now we haven't selected any of the image so here you can see these are the check boxes here so right now none of the images are selected so let me choose uh, these two files or uh, the images and once I click on delete selected it will delete the files from the server uh, for from this property and you and now we you can see only two files are there images are there which are related to this property so if you again delete select these two files and delete uh, them it will get deleted and it will show the messages no images uploaded so far start by uploading now so this is how the functionality is working uh, please test it in the production org and let me know if there are any issues i am deleting this test property now thank you